I'm really excited to show you this newest generation of Konica Minolta BizHub multifunction printers. These machines have come so far in the last few years, it's really amazing. As an example of that, right now I'm actually logged into the internet and you can browse the internet directly from the touchscreen display and you can access and print content off the web without even using a computer. So whereas that's a great feature, I know more commonly these machines are used as your day-to-day -day work group printer, scanner, and copy machine. And I wanna show you some of the ways that these machines have evolved in those areas. One of the things that I've done is I've set up this machine where you have the ability to go to menu and access a folder system where you can save, retrieve, and print commonly used materials directly from the machine. One of the ways this is helpful is, let's say you have a sales force and they commonly print brochures. What I've done is in this folder, I'm gonna highlight this prints folder and I'm gonna open the folder and I have a brochure saved in here. And not only is the brochure saved, but so are all the settings that go along with the brochure to give us the output that we desire. In this case, I'm gonna take an eight page document and I'm gonna have it set up so that it's paginated to come out as a booklet. The machine is gonna fold it. It's even gonna two point saddle staple it. And we're gonna do all that without even having to use a computer. So check this out. I'm gonna highlight the brochure and I'm gonna tell it that I wanna print it it's gonna show that all of the settings are already attributed to that file. And all I have to do is hit start and the file's already been processed. So if you have a big eight page PDF document, usually you have to wait for it to even start printing. But in this case, it starts printing as soon as we hit start. And again, it's gonna take these documents, the machine itself is gonna put them in the right page order. You're going to see it as it's doing the printing on larger 11 by 17 inch paper, which you can run from any of the paper drawers in this machine. And it's going to make this whole process easy, automated, and affordable. A lot of companies go to a UPS store type environment to print these brochures, and it might cost three or four dollars each. On this machine, we can print an eight panel brochure that's automatically folded, paginated, and two-point saddle stapled, excellent quality, and the entire brochure, it's less than 50 cents to print it on here. And that includes all the toner, the maintenance, the paper. It's absolutely amazing. Again, these machines have come so far. So in addition to that feature, one of the other things I really wanna show you that's really come a long ways is the type of media that you can print onto. What I mean by that is I've set up an example. I'm gonna go back into this user box and I'm gonna open the same prints folder. And what I've saved in here is a document and I'm gonna print it on a 100 pound cardstock. Not only is that really thick, but I'm gonna do it on glossy 100 pound cardstock. And I think you're gonna agree that the quality and the capability of that is absolutely amazing. So I just recall the print. I hit start, it's already been processed. It's gonna immediately start printing and it's gonna run through that 100 pound cardstock just like it's just like butter. Check this out. I think you'll agree that the quality of that is absolutely amazing. But look at the thickness of this paper. I mean, we're talking heavy, thick cardstock directly from the machine. And printing this kind of quality, depending on the plan you're on, is maybe six or seven cents each, including all of the toner. Again, these machines have come so far. But it's not just the ability to print brochures and do folding and be able to do heavy cardstock. I do recognize that for the most part, these machines are used for your day to day, printing invoices, printing letters, things of that nature. And in doing that, the machine is really, really, really effective. Um, one of the things I like to point out, you just saw how the folding worked when we did the brochure. If you're printing invoices or something that's going to be three folded to go into a traditional envelope, you can also ask this machine to print 
and tri-fold so that you can take finished folded invoices and put them right into an envelope with a perfect fold every time. Additionally, you can do corner stapling, you can do automatic hole punching. It's, again, these machines have come so far and they make it so automated, which will help you save time and energies in your office. One of the things that we use these machines for more and more is scanning. It gets to the point where we scan more often than we print and copy. And I wanna show you how that works. You can put a stack of up to 100 sheets in the automatic document feeder. They can be one-sided or two-sided sheets. And I can just go to the scan button and we have pre-programmed destinations. Those destinations can be any series of email addresses. It can scan to a folder. It can scan to a Dropbox folder. It can scan to a USB. It's up to you where you want to scan. And in any of those cases, you can pre-program it. So in this case, I'm gonna tell it to scan to my email. I'm also gonna have it scan to Isla's email. I'm just gonna highlight those two email addresses. I'm gonna hit start. The scan speed is 80 sheets per minute. And if you're scanning two-sided documents, scans both sides in a single pass. It's not like the older model where it had to pull the document back through. So it's gotten faster than ever and easier than ever to use. It's just amazing. So these pages have already been scanned. They're already sitting in my email. And um, again, it can be email or it can be folder. That choice is purely up to you. It doesn't have to be one or the other. You can have a combination of both of those types programmed onto the machine. One of the things I like to address and one of the differences between a freestanding model like the one we're standing in front of compared to a desktop printer is not only are the capabilities and quality higher, not only is it much more affordable to use because of the low cost per page of printing, but you also have the benefit of having multiple paper drawers. And these paper drawers all have the ability to do anything from small four inch by six inch paper to your regular letter size paper, all the way up to 12 by 18 inch paper, which is helpful if you are an architect or, or someone doing plans. You can do a full bleed 11 by 17 image and do that on an oversized 12 by 18 paper. That's something that in many professions, they have to go to a blueprint service and pay two, three, four dollars a page. On this machine, you can do a half plan to scale for two cents a page. So there's many capabilities, and I wanna kind of focus on just the things I think most people are gonna use, regardless of the ancillary features that you put into effect. And that's the ability to put any size paper up to 12 by 18. You can put up to 90 pound cardstock right in any of the paper drawers. Every one of the models comes standard with at least two of these 500 sheet drawers but you can also add a third or a fourth drawer to have up to four drawers total. There's an option also to add one 2,500 sheet paper drawer. So if you do a high capacity of printing and copying, you're not having to refill the machine, you know, every two days with paper. So I'm gonna go ahead and close up this door. Um, as a general overview of this device, it serves as a high-end color printer with the capabilities to do glossy, amazing photos to automatically create brochures. But for the day-to-day, -day, it has a 100-sheet document feeder with 80 page per minute scan speed, has the ability to do printing at the push of a button, and obviously it serves as a walk-up copier when you're just needing to make a quick copy. If you did want any more information on this machine, we're always happy to help you, and we welcome your call at Common Sense Business Solutions. You can reach us anytime at 707-528-2151. And if you want to see these machines in action and maybe bring in some of your own materials, it's an open invitation to visit our showroom in Santa Rosa, California. And we can put this machine to the test and show you any of the capabilities that would benefit your business. Thank you for giving me the opportunity to show you these amazing machines. And we look forward to hearing from you anytime we can be of help.